What up, what up, what up, Nick here with Chernobog Studio. Today we are going to be checking out this bad boy, the Archetype Nolly from Neural DSP. I have the trial, checking it out. I made a little demo song over here. You can see there's stuff happening over there. And we're going to dive in. We're going to listen to it. And I want you guys to tell me what you think. I have my ideas of what I think of the plugin. I would love to hear what you think. Do you think my tones suck? Do you like them? Do you think my playing sucks? Do you think the song is cool? Whatever you want to comment, you know, go ahead. I would love to hear from you. Um, so let's dive in and let's do this. Let's see what we get with this bad boy. This 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 bad boy right here. This uh, gnarly gnarly thing. All right. Studio. All right, we're back here in Studio One. Let's check out Archetype Nolly. And if you're wondering if there's any kind of processing or anything going on, aside from archetype Nolly, you can take a look at my signal chain here. This is all the uh, the I tracks over here on the left, and you can see it's feeding over into this final guitar bus, which only has Renaissance Axe uh, with these settings going on it. So that's all that uh, Renaissance Axe is doing, nothing crazy. Um, just kind of evening out things and dropping the uh, volume a little bit. I personally really like what Renaissance Axe does to guitar, so I typically find myself using it often. And then for the bass, I'm using Euro Bass 2 uh, with a little bit of extra stuff going on. Then we have Superior Drummer 3 with some kind of preset that I just threw on. I added a couple of stuff to the mix bus here, or sorry, the drum bus here to uh, make it a little bigger, fatter, whatnot. And finally, our little simple mastering chain here to bring things up a little bit louder. So yeah, that's that's basically it. Um, nothing fancy, nothing crazy. I just wanted to do a simple demo that kind of highlighted the kind of bass sounds that you get out of Archetype Nolly without spending you know a crazy amount of time tweaking, messing, thing, messing around with things and whatnot. Um, I think you should be able to get great sounds pretty quickly uh, right away. So that was kind of the idea with this little demo here. I just kind of uh, threw up Nolly, you know, started playing stuff, started tweaking, and this is kind of what I got uh, with a little bit of time. Overall, I think if you're looking for a plugin 
for low to mid gain tones i think you'll really really enjoy this plugin i think it sounds really great for the high gain stuff personally i'm not into it i know other guys feel the same way as i do and then there's other guys on the opposite end of the spectrum so i guess it really depends on the kind of sound that you're going for feel wise and everything like that i it does feel like the amps feel great they feel like a real amp the cabinet models for myself i'm not sure if i dig them that much uh i don't know if if i gotta spend a little bit more time and see what i can coax out of it but Ultimately, I think since I already have uh, NTS and Nameless um, for like mid to high gain tones, I'm much happier with what I get out of there. And I have other stuff that I can use for low, low to mid gain stuff. So ultimately for me, I think it's a pass just because it doesn't really add something to my arsenal that's kind of revolutionary and some that I really need or that I'm lacking. But overall, I think it's uh, it's definitely a really good job. Nameless just keeps kind of knocking it out of the park with everything they release. I highly recommend that you download the trial, check it out, see what you think for yourself because playing through it is really going to ultimately give you the the right idea of whether it's for you or if it's not. You know, if you feel inspired to write stuff with it, great, get it. If you feel like whatever. And, you know, it might be pass and save your money for something else. Save your money for the next Neural DSP guitar VST that comes out or whatever, you know. Well, we The world is your oyster right now. We have so many options. So, yeah, don't feel like you need to jump on everything that comes out and that YouTubers are hyping up. Well, that was it for the video. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment. Don't forget to dislike, you know, just live your life. Give me a comment. Give me a sub even better. Have a great day. How about that? See ya.